Welcome back everyone. I want to do a video for you tonight talking a little bit about um, these bad boy turkey bodies from Brett DeFreitas at Boondocks Taxidermy. I've been using them for a couple years now and um, I really like them. Uh, and I want to tell you a little bit about why I like them. Uh, you know, you could debate whether or not they're the best anatomically uh, made as far as, you know, reproducing what's actually inside a turkey. Uh, I think they're very, very good. You know, also you could look at Tim, uh, Tim Jordan's bodies or Harry Whitehead's bodies. They're they're also uh, equally good, I believe, as far as anatomy goes. Uh, what I believe the benefit is with these bad boy bodies is the system that you're getting. Uh, first is is these. Uh, this is a freeze dried head that I got from Brett, and uh, it fits down on this uh, neck and breast insert perfectly because he uses a foam insert inside the head when he freeze dries it that is the same shape okay so when so this head will fit perfectly on here once you when you're ready to mount the bird you just cut the foam out uh, right there at the V and then it'll mount up really nice on this neck and breast insert so what I would do you could put a wire in here to hold this in if you wanted it more forward or more back uh, sometimes I do sometimes I don't it's not it's not required what I would do to, to get this mounted up is put the head on trace where my waddles and you know the head goes along this neck take it off mount the skin and then I get everything in position pull that skin up a quarter of an inch past that line and you could pin it in place or you could glue it down or whatever you want to do and then you can either let it dry and then put your head on or you can put your head on you know while the skin is still wet and and uh, move it around um, and basically all you do to put, attach your head is you can use some silicone caulk or I just use hot glue put a little hot glue up in the head stick it down seems to work pretty good um, you can you know this neck and breast insert to me is a, is a real time saver versus having to you know make a neck with foam and and wire and make sure it's the right length and then you still have to fill this area out if you don't use something like this um he makes these in in different poses you can get strutting flying uh walking whatever um but but this you know filling this out with this foam it's a flexible foam uh, saves you a lot of time. You don't have to fill this up with caulk. I do use a, some caulk in here to hold things in place, but not as a filler. And you don't you don't have to use any kind of batting or anything like that. It's it's got the filling made in there. So to me, that's a real time saver. Uh, as far as the way the body's set up, um, if you go on turkeyheads.net, Sprett's website, you can download a flyer or an instruction sheet about how long to make your wing bones how long to make your leg bones <clears throat> and uh, you know for and there's a different lengths for the small medium large extra large whatever so cut your uh, bones to the size specified and it'll work pretty good um, I have had a few where I thought maybe they needed a a little bit extra length but um, you know it could have been my cutting also but for the most part it seems to work very well um, I go ahead and do the uh, feet, get them injected, painted, and uh, get them attached to the body. And uh, I'll get, every, get, every, get this body completely set up before I mount it. And um, again, this will save me a lot of time versus uh, having to use the whole wing bone and cut this out so it lays in there nice and, um, and all that. Now let me talk a little bit about the legs. You can use a, a drumstick. I think Brett sells one that'll fit with this. I don't use it for a commercial piece, which is, is what I'm working on here. Um, I really don't see a need for commercial birds, uh, especially in a strutting pose. Uh, maybe in a walking pose or something where, where that uh, thigh, that uh, drumstick and all is, is a little more exposed. The customer could see it. You might want to use uh, either that or some cotton fill or something. But I'll just just mount it up straight over this, and it'll be fine. Um, that's pretty much all I've got to say about them. Like I said, I think they're they're really good. I think they're time savers. Um, you know, 
I've been using them, like I said, for a couple of years. I highly recommend them. Um, you know, Brett's not paying me to, to say all this, but uh, just try one out if you haven't, and I believe you'll like it. And uh, make sure you get the neck insert. You don't it don't come with the body. You have to order that separate. Um, if you guys got any questions or comments, be sure to leave them below. And uh, I appreciate anybody uh, rating and subscribing uh, to the channel. Uh, it just helps get the word out, and you can stay informed whenever I release a new video. It'll show up in your uh, feed. Uh, thanks for watching.